Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name's Kelly from Kelly Lee Creates and I teach lettering and digital design tutorials. So today I have a tutorial for you on Silhouette Studio and I'm going to show you two ways to use the weld function in Silhouette Studio. I'm going to show you how to use it with text and I'm going to show you how to use it with shapes and um, tell you why you would want to use uh, the weld uh, tool in each case. So I just want to start off by saying that I am using the designer edition of Silhouette Studio. There are different editions with the basic edition being the free edition that comes with the software when you download it. The designer edition is an upgrade from the basic edition and there's also um, the business edition and I think maybe if another edition higher than the business edition, but I am using the designer edition. So everything that I show you um, in this tutorial can be done in the designer edition and above. So if you're having problems with this tutorial, if things aren't working for you, if, uh, if the weld function isn't working, if you don't have the weld function available, it might be because you are using the basic edition. So I, if you're having problems, I would first go and check and see what edition of Silhouette Studio you are using because the basic edition is very, very limited. So if you're, if you are having any problems, check to see what edition you are using first. Okay, with that being said, now I'm going to show you how to use the weld function with text and shapes. So I'm just going to open up a brand new canvas and I'm going to come over here to the text panel and just type out a simple word, hello. And I'm going to leave it in the default uh, font that Silhouette Studio uh, types your text out with. And if I come over here to the send panel, you can see that when we type this uh, text out, you can see that each letter is going to be cut out on its own. The letters aren't connected in any way and they're going to be cut out separately. But what happens if we want to cut out a script font? So I'm just going to change this text to a script font really quickly. And you do that by coming over here to the uh, text style panel. And the script font that I'm going to choose is Lofty Goals. Now this font does not come with Silhouette Studio. It's a font that I downloaded. Um, so if you want to know how to get different fonts into Silhouette Studio, I will leave a link to that below. But so here we have the word hello typed out in a script font. And you can see that where the letters connect, there is an overlap. And the way that looks in the send panel is like this. So if you were to cut out this word right here as is, all these little pieces would cut out and your text would not cut out in one piece and you would have to piece it all back together, which is a nightmare. So to avoid that, what we do is we use the weld tool. And it's very easy. You just select your text and you come over here to the modify panel and weld is here in the upper left hand corner. And all you do is click on that. And when you do that, you can see now that all your text is welded together. So if you come over here to the send panel, now you can see that there is no, there are no overlapping lines. And this text is going to cut out all in one piece, which is what we want when using script text. So the next way I'm going to show you how to use the weld tool is with shapes. So I'm going to just create a new canvas right here. And I'm just going to use a cloud as an example. I'm going to come over here to my drawing tools and click on the ellipse tool and just draw out a few different size circles here like so and if I go to the sun panel over here you can see that they're all going to cut out separately and 
they are going to have some overlap right here. So if you want to cut this out and have it be a cloud and have it be all one shape, you do that with the weld tool and same way as you did with the text. This time you're just gonna select each circle, come over here to the modify panel and click weld. And there you now have your shape that you can cut out all in one piece. So I hope this gave you a good overview on how to use the weld tool in Silhouette Studio on um, two different ways and why you would want to use it. If you like this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any new videos. And if you want more tutorials on Silhouette Studio, check out my blog at kellyleecreates.com. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.